Take one. Good day, folks. I'm Mick from Iron Fem. <laughs> <laughs> Cut. <laughs> Good day, folks. I'm Mick Van Sale from Ironman 4x4. I get asked quite often, which is better? Steel cables or synthetic ropes on your winch? So I'm going to run through a couple of pros and cons of both of them. I'm not going to keep the cable in my hands. It's very heavy. And that's the first point. The steel cable is very heavy. Anywhere between 21 and 30 kilograms for a cable on a winch. A synthetic rope is less than one kilogram. So you're saving anywhere between 20, 25, 30 kilograms of weight on the front of your four-wheel drive. If you're a serious overlander and every kilogram counts, that's a significant weight saving by fitting a synthetic rope as opposed to a cable. Now, they both do the same job and one isn't better than the other one essentially. You're saving weight first and foremost. The synthetic rope is about 50% stronger than the steel cable, but the steel cable in itself is very, very strong. Unless the cable is damaged, you're not going to overstress the cable. So the strength of the synthetic rope is really, it's academic at the end of the day. Where it does come into play is if you have a rope failure. Bear in mind that when you're winching with a winch cable, the cable will actually stretch. And if you have a cable failure, that cable will come whipping through the air. And if there are any bystanders in the way, they can get seriously injured. So always make sure that there are no bystanders around when you're winching and always use a winch damper blanket. Whether you're winching with a cable or with a rope, definitely use a winch damper blanket or two if you can. With a synthetic rope, the rope actually doesn't stretch and if it should snap, it'll just drop down to the ground. But notwithstanding that, always use a winch damper blanket. Another advantage of the synthetic rope is that should the rope snap, you can splice the rope, in other words, uh, attach the two pieces together, or even just make a knot in it, and you can continue your winch recovery. If your steel cable, however, snaps, you can't make a knot in it, and there's no way in which you can attach the end that snapped back onto the drum of the winch, so the winching is pretty much done for the day. So those are the basic differences between the cable and the winch rope. The synthetic rope. The cable is way cheaper than the rope. The ropes are normally four to five times the price of a winch cable. So if you're looking to save money, cable is the way to go. If you're looking to save weight, the synthetic rope is the way to go. Those are the basic pros and cons of both of these. I prefer the winch rope uh, because it's lighter on the front of my truck and I am sensitive to, to weight on the vehicle. But they're both, they both do the same job at the end of the day. So I hope that helps.